Hey everyone, it's Miss Newen. Um, I just wanted to really quickly go over how to add your Google Classrooms correctly, how to check PowerSchool, um, and how to make sure you're ready to go for the first day of school because this virtual learning thing is totally new for all of us. So if you log on to PowerSchool with your own info, um, you should be able to see your schedule. And I know they're still making changes, but please be patient. Um, hopefully those things will be updated soon. So when you look at your schedule, it might look something similar to this. You'll have your classes, you'll have your teacher names, and next to it, you'll have a bunch of these like random letters and um, numbers. That is your Google Classroom code. So for example, um, for AP Environmental Science, my Google Classroom code is RAFPQL4. Cool, what am I gonna do with that information? I'm gonna hop over to classroom.google.com. So, um, in your search bar, classroom.google.com, it'll ask you to sign in. Um, so make sure you sign in with your wccschools.org email because that's what's gonna be linked to Google Classroom. All right, so you're gonna have this home screen. It might have boxes here, it might not. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on this plus sign here and you're gonna press join class. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take that classroom code that, um, is on your power school and you're going to add it so raf pql or right and then once you do that you'll be able to join the class and i'm not going to do that with mine but you can go ahead and do that with all of your google classroom codes you'll find something that looks like this so you'll have um, a banner with your class code info make sure you're in the right class um, this stream tab right here it might have announcements it might have anything like that um, and then your classwork tab is going to be where you find all of the information for the assignments uh, maybe important links uh, maybe an overview for the week etc and so on so this is how you're going to get the information for class to start on monday please try to add these Google Classrooms into your own Google Classroom before Monday starts. Get acquainted with kind of where things are and then make sure you have a Zoom link or you're ready to go with um, what your teacher is planning on doing on Monday. Cool. I wish you all the very best start to the school year um, and we're super looking forward to seeing you all virtually.